Okay. What's in here? Looks like there's more people in here. I think that's some more of my squad. Is it? It's should, Daniels and Beckett. Should I help them? There's got to be a way to revive them with their memories intact. Huh. So they won't attack us on sight. I think I may be able to use this medical equipment to bring them out of stasis properly. Ah, the okay. The aliens have already injected them with all sorts of compounds I don't recognize. I don't know how it will affect them when they awaken. I don't know what to do. These guys are the last of my squad. They're my friends. If I revive them, maybe they can help us. I'm not sure they'll last very long, but if we leave them, you saw what the aliens did to the others. Good point. How can they last? How long can they last if you revive them? I don't know for certain. I can get them on their feet and moving for maybe a few minutes at best. There's no way for me to tell what the aliens have already subjected them to. I can't understand these readouts. Their pain could be horrible. This technology is out of my league, so I'm just going to have to improvise. It's the best I can do. Uh, I think I decide what we should do. Thanks. I'm re. Huh. Damn, I could convince him not to revive them. Or we could revive them and let them fight with us. Let's try that. Just remember, they won't be alive long, so we need to keep moving as fast as we can. I'm going to need to watch their vitals carefully as I use the medical console to pump them full of the correct fluids and bring them back. When I give the signal, you open the tubes with that switch. Don't open them until I tell you, or the results could be unpredictable. All right. Okay, let's see. This must initiate the thawing process. Okay, blood pressure looks normal. Heart rate, normal enough. Oh, I hope to God this works. Open the tubes. If I did everything right, I'll still be alive. All right, squad, listen up. I know you have no idea what's going on, but you just have to trust my insides. We were captured by the alien. What happened to us? The things that grabbed us from Anchorage. And now we're free. Here, take these weapons and follow me. Let's show them what some motivated U.S. soldiers can do. On me, squad. Let's go! Okay, let's put these guys to use. Wait just a second. Let me take some of this cryogenic compound back to the engine core. I might be able to make some use of it. Hmm. Okay, do it. What's on your mind? Sure, here you go. Oh, hey, what's up? Why are we stuck inside the laboratory? I think when we opened the door to the operating room, we set off some kind of containment alarm. The room seals itself up, and it looks like it's being flooded with some sort of decontamination gases. Pretty high-tech stuff. Unless I miss my guess, it will cycle itself and unlock the doors in a little bit. Huh. We'll just have to wait it out. How long? Not sure. Oh, the door opened. Ready, dude? Let's go. Take these troops with us. Kick some fucking ass. Hells yes, we got a fucking squad, dude. This is what we're supposed to blow up, right? This thing? Maybe not. Let's go. Let's figure this out. Here they are. You fucking motherfucker. Yes. Alrighty. Where's that guy we just killed? Fucking ash pile. Oh shit! I fucking froze them by accident. <laughs> that was funny. You can freeze your teammates by accident.
vieron. Fucking nice. <laughs> Behind. Quick. No, they're not. They're not doing shit. Oh, this guy died. Look. Private Becky got owned. They're flanking us from behind. What a joke. I'm flanking them from behind. That's what's happening. So that's the generator. Now, how the heck can we destroy it? What is? What's he talking about? Look, a teleporter. This is the generator? Ah, it is the generator. He's like fucking walked in, I didn't even see him. Fucking asshole. Leave him alone. I think we blew up the generator. Looks pretty blown up to me. <laughs> Damn, the other dude died too. That sucks. Oh well. I guess that's it. I guess we go back now through this. 